Yo, what's up guys, Mark here. Um, today I'm gonna be showing you how to get an auto clicker for iOS slash iPhone. Um, your iOS version is not gonna matter. This is, I mean, this can be used for any game, but today in particular, we're going to be doing this for Dragon Ball Z Dokkan Battle since a lot of people have asked me for this. Um, so I will be showing you guys how to do this uh, now. So let's go to Safari, All right? Let's go to Safari now. This is the website uh, where they host uh, pretty much the app that we're going to need. I'm going to have it. Uh, there's going to be a link in the description. You could just click on it and it'll immediately download. Um, you're going to need this for uh, a future. I'm going to do another video. So in today's video, this is going to be for uh, jailbroken users. But if you know if this video can get at least 20 likes, I will show you guys how to how to do this pretty much without jailbreak. It's super duper simple. Um, I do advise you guys to uh, just look all the way to the end of the video because this process is very, very, very similar to the non-jailbroken portion. Even though I'm going to cover that, I'm going to cover the process and stuff like that in the non-jailbreak video if you know it can get enough likes and stuff. But uh, this is pretty much is pretty much the exact same way, right? So, um, so this this is going to be the link right here. You see, the iGame Guide Jail Deb. That is the that's going to be the uh, the app. You know in quotation marks that's gonna be the app that we're going to in, in, install here right so um i'll have this link also in the description of course just in case i guess you know just in case you guys you know just in case the other link doesn't work and i'll make sure i have this so uh you know you guys have jailbreak right so you guys should have cydia here um so what we're gonna need for this we're gonna need uh we're gonna need fauza and i mean that's pretty much it i mean that's all we need is fauza right and then obviously dokkan battle right so no, this is Fauza here. Just type in Fauza. You guys should have this repo. If not, then uh, just let me know if you guys don't have the repo in the comments, and then I'll uh, go ahead and you know send that to you guys. So Fauza uh, file manager. This you know make sure you guys just go ahead and install it and whatnot. Um, you know obviously it says it works all the way up to iOS 16, so you guys should be able to do this. But this, like I said, this is for jailbreaking users. For unjailbreaking, uh, unjailbroken, you guys are not going to need files, all right? So, um, so let's go, right? We we downloaded the iGame uh, game guide jail dev, right? And then here it is, right? This is what we're going to need to use. So, uh, what I like to do is I like to click that, and then I like to go ahead and um, scroll down a little bit, and then this, you see where it says save to files. So I go ahead and do that. I click save. And then we can just get out of Safari. We're done with Safari, right? So then let's move over to Files here. And then uh, as you it, like, as soon as you guys open Files, the app should like it should take you immediately to where the where you just downloaded it from. So here's the dev. You know, it says dev file. You know, you guys could see the 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 info and stuff like that. So just go ahead and click install. Um, I've already clicked installed. You know, after it does this little thing. You know, I, you know what? Let me just click install again. Why not? So it'll it'll show this, right? Um, you don't you do not have to respring, but you know, you guys can go ahead and respring. Um, it's just it's just saying all this extra stuff. It's just doing all this extra stuff since I already had it installed already. So we're just doing all this extra stuff. Um, but you know, like I said, just guys just make sure that this runs fully stuff like that. Um, and then you guys can respring afterwards, but I you know I really don't need to do that since uh, you know, already have it downloaded, right? So then this is where I put my app. This is the iGame God. So it was a dev file, but it will like show up on your home screen as an actual app. And for you unjailbroken users, it will show. Um, I don't. It won't like be an app. It will just be injected into the game, right? So let's go on to iGame God here. And um, as you see, we it shows all of our apps, right? So like I said, we're just doing this. This works for JP Dokkan. It works for uh, Legends, and it, you know it works for Dokkan, like regular global Dokkan as well. Um, so let's just, you know, let's go ahead and take Dokkan Battle here. So, and then now, for now, we can just instantly go into Dokkan Battle, right? So this, this, this mod or whatever, it has extra features like memory editors and all this stuff like that. Me personally, I only use it for the, uh, so it also has a speed hack as well, which it, it would just make things, well, first off, it doesn't work for online services. So like Dokkan, Legends. The speed hack does not work for those games since it's online server based but for other like games like offline type games you can use the speed hack and it will speed things up right so 
uh, like I see, so you can go ahead, you can, you can click it, you can just like tap it, but then uh, if you just tap it, that will open up the memory editor. I guess I'll just show that. Um, a little advertisement will show up, you can just go ahead and close that. So this is the memory editor portion, which like I said, you cannot use this in online server-based games, Dokkan, Legends. You could try, you know, you go ahead, right? You can try, but it's not going to work. Um, and then, uh, but we're here for the, we're here for the uh, auto clicker, right? So you want to hold down on that. And then you see where it says speed hack and then touch recorder, you click touch recorder. So touch recorder, this is the actual auto clicker here. Um, let me just log in stuff like that. Um, you guys cannot get banned for this. This is just a auto clicker and that's all we're using it for. You know, if you guys are really scared of getting banned, then yeah, please do not use the memory editor and please do not use the speed hack, um, stuff like that. Um, but like I said, we're using the memory editor, right? So, you know, you guys could use this for, for example, the All-Stars EZA. Uh, me personally, I did not use this for the All-Stars EZA, but you guys could definitely do so. Um, so we're going to, we're going to use this uh, to link level really quick. I just want to show you guys how you guys can use this to link level. So this is, this is how we do it, right? So we're going, we're going to do 34. We're going to do stage 34. And then let's just, we, so we start it once, right? So let's just start it. And then uh, we, we have to beat it once, right? So let's just go ahead and beat this. Um, yeah, let's just go ahead and beat this. I'll probably fast forward this part and then we'll come back. Uh, we'll, you know, we'll just go ahead and come back once um, this is pretty much done. So I'll see you guys in a minute. All right, guys, we're back. Um, so that was so we we have like I said, we have to complete the stage first, right? So then this is what this is what we do. Uh, so you want to go ahead and you want to tap this little icon here. Um, let me let me stop it first, really quick. Okay, so right there, right. So you so as soon as you tap that little icon, that's when the 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 recording will start. So let's go ahead and do this. So you want to tap that; it's recording, right? So you want to click attempt again. Wait just like a second. I'm gonna click OK. Then just wait just a second and then click start. Boom. So it's recording. Everything is good. You don't have to, you don't have to click anything else for this. Just sit here, just sit back, relax. Um, and then I guess in the meantime, I'll tell you guys about this, this auto clicker, right? So this auto clicker is definitely way worse than the Android counterpart. And I'll I'll do a video on Android as well. Um, on the auto clicker you guys could use for this. Um the Android one is just way better, right? But you know, iOS, you know, it is what it is, right? Um, with this auto clicker, there's no really like smart, uh, like functionalities. There are some other auto clickers out there that you guys could use. Uh, that's probably jailbroken. Um, I just know for a fact that this one, you can use non -jail jailbroken. So that's why I picked this one. There's like I said, there's some other ones that have like scripts, but most of those scripts are kind of paid so it's just i just stay away from those this one i've used this a couple times and it, it does work fairly decent um you guys are you guys are gonna have to time things you know just take just take account into uh like your your, your rank you know if you're leveling up a lot you know, like different okay symbols and stuff like that i'm gonna show that right after this just in case like a like a friend thing pops up or like uh, you know you level up i have like i've created like insurances quote unquote on how to like get past that little hurdle and stuff like that um but like i said this this auto clicker it's it's it's, it's okay right like you guys can use this to to link level stuff like that do dope kind of events for yourself it's just like the these inputs they don't they don't stick right like, and what i mean by that is if you close the app and come back in you're gonna have to redo it but like i said it's, it's not really a big deal like trust me it's not really a big deal um, but obviously once we're done with this recording, it will stick as long as you stay in the game, right? So like, even if I click this, uh, so you see that stop sign, we, you know, when, once we're done with this recording session, we will undo the stop sign here. Um, 
like we'll click we'll click the stop sign and that's how you guys want to stop the recording you don't want to click pause like ever you don't ever want to click pause um you guys should for the most part just use stop and then that's pretty much about it okay so we we finished raditz we beat raditz here yep we're getting we're getting we're getting our link levels and stuff like that um so we're done right so we're, we're done with this um now the way i like to do this um and you, you guys could probably improvise a little bit better um, but like what I like to do is, so let, let's just say for example, some props came, some prompts came up, right? So what I like to do is I just like to tap like around the screen, stuff like that around this area. Cause like, for example, if a friend, uh, notification pop up, like cancel will be like around here. Uh, if you rank up, I think, okay, will be like somewhere around here. You just, you really just want to tap this like a little bit and then, um, just keep tapping it just for like a second and then just click uh, attempt again. Just click OK. And then now you guys um, can go ahead and click this stop symbol here. And then you guys could click uh, this, this little like uh, basically like the reverse thing or whatever. Like the, I, I don't, I don't know. I don't know what you call it. Right? Like the, the loop and then it will pretty much loop your thing. Right. So as you guys saw, it was a little couple, it was like a little bit of extra inputs there because I, I did kind of make a mistake. You don't actually have to do, you don't actually have to click that attempt again thing, but it, it's still good just in case some extra prompts came up that requires you to tap the screen. It's still a good, still a good way to go ahead and uh, continue. So the reason why we have all these extra prompts is because we don't want this to stop. We don't want things to slow down. We don't want things to, you know, you know keep us from going right like this is something i i can imagine you guys just have this on just have your phone charged while you're probably you know going to work or you know something and then you come back home and then you know you guys are full old 10 links or something like that right so um i just uh we're just gonna sit here for a little bit just show the fact that you know this little prompts the all this stuff i just wanted to show that it'll redo it by itself like i'm not touching the screen right uh, like I said, make sure you guys click that loop, that little loop icon, and then it'll just loop it over and over again. Um, if you guys click stop again, the loop button, the play button, all that stuff will show back up. So if you guys accidentally stop it, you guys can just redo it again. If you guys want to fix your script, like fix your little, you know, make it, you know, make it a little bit faster, then just go ahead and click stop and then click the trash can. And then I'll delete your little recording and you guys can start a new one. Right. So um we will like i said we'll just go ahead and show this off i'm just going to prove to you guys that it'll restart by itself and then we'll go ahead and end the video here so this was the this is for jailbreak but like i said it's very very similar for non-jailbreak if this video can get like 20 likes then i will do a non-jailbreak video super duper easy um and then like i said i will be doing an android video um as well um definitely for android it's way better because it's, it's actually like a smart it's like a smart auto clicker so you know you can you guys can have instances it just it's just it's just way better in my opinion um and you know you guys can use this for dokkan events you guys could use this for link levels you guys could also use this for the all-stars easy a you know you guys are gonna have to have like actual like good teams <laughs> you guys are gonna have to like you know use good teams but i've i've um I've used this for the All-Stars Easy, at least on my JP account, and it definitely works, right? Uh, like I said, you guys could easily make this a lot faster. You know, we're just sitting here for a little bit because you never know, like, when teams, like, maybe they'll, like, you know, it'll take a little it'll take a little while to actually go ahead and, you know, beat the stage sometimes. You never know what will happen. So that's why I just, I, you know, I space things out. But I'm sure you guys could easily refine this, make it faster go ahead and you know get record record auto clicker times and stuff so obviously you know those are my inputs from earlier and stuff like that um like i said we'll just make sure that it redoes it on its own and then we will continue well well we'll end the video all right um but yeah i hope you guys enjoyed hopefully this helped a lot of you guys out um thank you guys for watching and uh and i'll see you guys in the next video that was the auto clicker i'll see you guys in the next one peace